Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to set function key to default. So on the very top row of your keyboard, you will find function key like F1, F2, F3, which helps you to increase or decrease the sound, increase or uh, decrease the brightness. So if the function key has been locked and if you want to set it to default, then in the very top row, on the very top row, you will find the key which has the function lock icon. Here you can see in my case, in my computer, the escape key has the function lock here you can see the lock sign lock sign so sometimes accidentally we press it and the function key is actually locked so to enable it you have to find the key which has this function lock it may be escape or many maybe any other button so when you press this function lock it will help you to lock or unlock the function key so you can press that button but in many computer uh, this is the button fn plus escape key in my computer when i press the Fn key and while holding the Fn key, if I press the escape key, which has the function uh, lock button, so Fn plus escape will help me to lock or unlock the function button. So you can press that and check in many computers. Now, once you find the key, which has the function lock button, you can press that key or you have to press Fn button along with that function lock key or sometimes you have to press the shift button along with that function lock key so you have to first of all you have to find which key has this function function lock button this button then you have to press fn plus that function lock key or shift plus fn lock key or maybe only the fn lock key to enable or disable the function lock in few computers f12 button may act as a function lock button so check in some computers f12 has that function lock icon and in in many computers, it's Fn plus shift, which helps you to lock or unlock the function key. So this is how you can set the, the function to default on your Windows computer. If I was of any help, then you can support my channel. So you can click on these three dots. You can click on thanks and you can support my content over here. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.